Hey, hey, Jelly Toast here, back with more Residents of Fate. Let's go dress myself up in pretty clothes. Let's also go to the guild and get our missions. That is also a thing that I should do. Can't wait to find out who Antorion is. If I remember correctly, I think he's an old dude. And he wasn't that cool. And I think I have to beat him up. Or maybe that's just my wishful thinking. Uh, lady in the red. Shipment of materials have been awfully slow. My shop will go under if this keeps up. Authentic cuisine. I want my ma, she lives out in the countryside, to have a taste of real gourmet cuisine. Won't someone take this ultra first class mega pricey dish to her? I put my all into preparing it. Let it to my girl. If it's not a nuisance, can someone run an errand for me? Give me a shout if you're nearby. Oh, huh, okay, so they're all like fetch missions. Nice. I don't mind those too much. If they're fighting missions though, I'm just like, oh gosh, I don't want to fight too much. That's annoying. Bam. Dress me up in cute things, please. Uh, hey, give me money. What's that? Hey, 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 give me money. Um, what else? There was something I wanted to say regarding the cutscenes of this game, oh. but I forgot what it is. Could I ask you guys to play courier for me? Can you get the materials directly from Daryl down in Cranktown? So I gotta go to Cranktown. Aren't you the cutest little thing? I'm the cutest little thing. This time we dress you up in B. Which? Aw, that's cute. But no. Treasure? That's gaudy. Oh gosh, no. Flower? Uh, maybe? Truth? Haha. <laughs> that's manly, Pater. Um. No, not Blossom. I guess she already has- Oh wait, I don't think I could have, um... <gasps> Should I just blow all my money on that skirt? I think I will. I think I will. I'm gonna blow it. I'm gonna blow all my money. There we go. We, we done. <laughs> uh, Zephyr, go back into A. I don't think I could buy new clothes until, um, I do this mission for this lady. Okay, so then I'll just change their outfits for now into next something different. Because hmm? I wore these clothes two chapters ago. Um, either. Oh man, but these are all their like classic stuff. I already wore these. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn. There's no point in changing their outfits. What the heck? I don't care about the pearl. Moss. Many. That's his typical one. Gosh darn it. Okay. I'm just gonna leave them in that for now. Oh wait, but I can change Leanne's shirt. Sorry. Changing Leanne's shirt. Because she got a new skirt! It's a skirt. Skirt that I love too. Should I give her a plain white? That's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. Changing her shoes though. Smoothie. Ooh, ooh, she looking so cute. I'm loving this. Y'all don't know how much I'm loving this so far. White gloves. Blue gloves. She already wore those. Red. Nah. I don't want to give her that. Let's give her white gloves. Oh my gosh, she looks so freaking cute. I am dying. Uh, tiger, white, leopard. No. How about giving her just a plain headband? Black to go with her boots? <sighs> Something girly as an accent? Palm. Oh, yeah. I think I'll give her something girly as an accent. Yeah. And then, let's see. Oh wait, no, I want to go back to her belts. Um, zoom in. Uh, classical. Qu 
four. Gives me that black blood. Oh no. Flight. I think I'll go for four. Just so that it has black along with her boots. And uh, black hair? No, nah, that's a little too harsh. Uh, do I want to give a different colored eyes though? Green, gold, purple? Yeah, let's go for purple. I haven't given her any crazy eye colors yet. Any cute glasses? You know, too strong, too strong. Nope. Okay, we will leave her like this. Okay. I forgot how to register outfits as favorites, but she looking oh, so cute. So cute. I'm loving this. Oh, I just love dressing up Leanne. She's so freaking adorable. I can't wait until I make her jump and spin in battles. <laughs> okay, um, well, since I want new clothes- oh wait, I don't even have money for new clothes. Damn it, because I blew it all on the skirt. Wow, let's go after the machine gunners first. Why are they all here? Care to dance? No point in switching targets because I'm almost done. Your bones click. You be careful. Sucker! There we go! Spin! No, she's not spinning. Well, she was spinning, but not in the right way. But anyway, panty shot! That's why I love that skirt. Oh, I'm such a weirdo. Just charge up that much of ship in that Oh, wow, I saw multiple dudes. Kill him dead. Kill him dead. Ooh, I forgot to charge up Bash a little more. Where's the other guy that had a lot of scratch damage? Oh, we got him. Whoops. Is there now? Uh, let's go after you, because you got machine gun. And I think you're going to be annoying. Bye. But it is over. You guys are going to die real soon. Bye. Oh, damn it. She only has one handgun. Bye. Oh man. Okay. I think uh Bash might need to hit him up one more time. I really want more bezel shards. I think this guy said if I unlock hexes in level 12, I should be able to get more shards. That was more fun than I thought it'd be. Ooh, sorry, hit my mic. Hopefully that didn't make a loud noise. Uh crank down. This way. What the freak are you doing in front of Lucia? Oh, red hex there. Should I attempt red hex right now? Let's go over and see what it is. She can kill him on her own. Barely. Ah, panty shots. All the panty shots. Stop messing around. I don't mind going after the human enemies because they do drop a. Uh... Get away from me. They do drop hexes. So I guess this isn't that annoying. At least these are like the easiest dudes ever. This must be my lucky day. Now I know why this skirt costs so freaking much. It's just a clear panty shot for Leanne. I can do this. Oh my gosh, I don't have the magazine case equipped. It's because I didn't save it from my last attempt at... Go ram it. 
I don't think I can even properly try... Oh, no, I can. No, but I'm gonna run into the dudes and they're gonna stop me from running. Damn it. And she has Molotov cocktails. Yeah, she's spinning! Woo! Leanne, don't get sick because you're not wearing any pants under your skirt. I should dress them all up in just classic white shirt, uh, blue jeans. That would be pretty hot, actually. I'm getting excited thinking about it. Aw, oh, me. I know it's Zephyr and Fash's turn to uh, be A outfits, but the idea of just having white shirts and blue jeans is too tough. I pressed X, you mother trucking game. Excuse you. How dare you. Look at his butt. That's so gross. I was going to just stay on the ground to shoot him, but I saw that his armor had a little tiny area left. I was like, oh, that's not gonna hit his body. So, uh, here we go. You're going down. Yes, thankfully, we killed his arm so that I didn't run into it. I won't take that line down. Shoot his butt! Oh no, they're all getting up a bash. Let's just break his gauge. Charge up, charge up, charge up. Break his gauge, break it, break it. Mother flippin' you didn't. I hope he has enough room to jump out. Yes, he did, thank goodness. It would kill them. Uh I don't have to run, but might as well. It's fun. Oh no! I'm glad I ran. Oof. If I just stood still and shot him. Basil First. Shard! See, why was that red hex in the last chapter so freaking ridiculously hard? It makes no sense. I wonder when I'll be able to fight like they do. I wanna be where the people are. There. Oh man. Okay, once I go to Cranktown, I'm gonna have to go to the hotel. I'm gonna have to change their outfits. Let's coordinate to be same now. Were they too weak or same color scheme for everyone. I'm getting too excited. I love character customization! Like in a lot of games, they're like, build your own character, change their features, different eye colors, different body structures. I love spending so much time on that, and then the actual game, I'm just like, I'm done. Case in point, Dragon... The hell? Dragon Age. Spent so much time making the character. Didn't finish the game. This is a freaking... ton of people! Let's go after the chunky gangster. Why are there so many freaking cones in this chapter? Is the story mission, like, that terrible? Did they just ramp up the difficulty just exponentially? What is happening? Uh, hit his body, please. How about we hit this... I don't know who to aim for. I can't even do leader salt on these guys because there's no leader, because it's a freaking yellow black safety cone. Let's go after this chunky gangster, I guess. Charge up fast, charge up fast, charge up fast a lot. There we go. Hit him. Leanne, it all takes one. Is there someone closer? Someone closer? Nope, I wasted time. Where did all of them come from? Why are all you here? I have to do this two more times to get to Cranktown. This freaking sucks. Is this the chapter where they're like, 
Oh man, now you're gonna feel the full force of people just coming after you. Feel pressure, feel rush. Things are getting serious now. Oh, you're a machine gunner. Yeah, you're stunned. Go after all the chunky gangsters first. But they annoying. Oh yeah, one good thing. They'll give me hexes. Where should I run so that Vash can create a nice triangle for us? Here. And then we can do a two resonance try attack. I know I could probably build up more, but these guys are too far away for us, so two resonance should be fine. Now you run this way. And if there's a chunky gangster in the way, we shoot him. Oh no, he's gonna be too far. I'm gonna miss everything. Never mind, that was pretty good. You big meanie? Leave me alone. Okay, uh, now we go this way. You for real? You didn't hit his body? Uh, who's closer? You seem closer to all of us. Oh, you're only a- You're only a shotgun shady thug! Gosh darn it! That was not charged up enough. Ah, oh, damn it, I hit the wrong target. There's too many dudes. That's what she said. <laughs> Sorry, terrible joke. Chunky gangster, here we go. Get rid of the chunks. Eh, yeah, that's not bad. And still, Vasheron is only level 24 with the machine gun. What is happening, dude? What? Just why? Let's just go straight across. Hit his face! Yeah! Woohoo! Extra hits are all the spawn. Oh, I accidentally hit the the small guy too. Uh, I think Zephyr can kill him. Let's see, Bash is over there, which means if I want a nice try attack, I should end up somewhere around here. Which means you live another day, sir. Instead, I come after you. I guess I'll go after all these small fry and leave the chunky gangster for last. And then after this recording session, I'll go to supermarket. Get some food so that I can live another day. Uh, go after you. And two resonance. Whee! Yes! And then I'll go with Leanne. Make Bash on second. We go after Chunks. Oh wait, maybe we shouldn't have gotten that for Chunks. Because Bash on's getting further away. Oh no, he's dead. Never mind. Whoops. Yes, right in front of his face. There's one guy left! You for real? Ugh, let's shotgun you so I kill you faster. Gosh. There we go. Die, please. Bye bye. Sucker. Now two more times so I can go to Tank Town. And I got all those dudes in front of Lucia too. What the heck? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Spot in all of eight dudes. Just this is madness. This is not fun. Game, what made you think that fighting eight guys in one battle would be fun and interesting? It's not. 
please just hit his body. Go after him. Oh, I shouldn't have him gone after the middle guy. I should have saved him for the try attack. Duh. Ugh. Well, you live and learn. Let's get rid of this guy. Bash doesn't have to charge up too much. So start running towards him, Bash. Start to There we go. Shoot him. Shoot him. Woohoo! Bash is not gonna hit him. Stunned him, so that's good. At least. Bash, who can we go after now? This chunky gangster. Sure. Go after all the chunks. Not discriminating, it's just they're a higher level. I wanna get rid of them ASAP. Ow! Leave me alone. You guys are annoying. Like, for real. Anyone else I can shoot in the face directly? Oop. Gotcha! Getting too far! Oh, I finished running anyway. Is there anyone that's close to death? Let's see... Where can I run so that Bash Run will have a good place to stop running? I guess I'll run this way and... Shoot this chunky gangster, why not? He has two handguns, he can deal a lot of damage. Do chunky gangsters even have blood? I thought they were robots. Yes! Okay. And now you can run and shoot this guy. And then I don't know who we're gonna try attack. Who do you think you're oh my gosh. That didn't even hit his body. That sucks. I mean, I guess I can have either Leanne or Zephyr run somewhere else and we can have a better triangle. I think I'll have Zephyr run. We can have a better triangle situated down here because there seem to be more dudes here. Okay. That's what I'll do. Bye! What are you Kill him, please. This useless thug. Whoa! I didn't think I'd get that one. That one was a tiny area. Yes, shoot him one more time. Get him. Yes. That's my boy. And now I have three residents. Uh, we'll go after that guy. Fast round, we'll go second. Oh, it's a pretty small triangle, so this will end pretty quickly, huh? Ah, jump to make sure I hit his body. Otherwise, we'll just hit his back. Uh, there we go. And that's it for. Oh no, I shouldn't have jumped. I was staring him right in the face. And I think I only have two chunky gangsters left. Nice. Uh, who cares about hero running at this point? Jump. Yes! Shot right down at his head. Of course, that only hit his armor. Should I just skip Zephyr's turn and let. Yeah, I'm gonna skip Zephyr's turn this time around. And let Bash scratch him up real quick. Skip. Go shoot the chonks! At least they're leaving us energy hexes, dude. Yeah, sure, run. Uh, 
Woo woo! Oh, I forgot to sell all my silver chips. That probably would give me more money. To buy my clothes! One more battle. Oh gosh, this is gonna be the most boring episode in the world. Okay, so learning from my mistake, I'm gonna go after him first. That way I'll have three guys in the middle I could attack for try attack. Jump and hopefully hit his body. Or at least hit his back. There we go. Yes. Then we hit the shotgun, dude. Woo, panty shot. That was a direct panty shot. I just want to change them all into white shirts and blue jeans, dude. Like, work with me, please. Let me have this, guys. Hello, I'm pressing X. Whoa. Bash was done charging and I pressed X so that they can attack. Get a load of this. He's not gonna hit anything. Gosh. Yeah, that was nothing. Another smackdown? Another smackdown. This is like the most boring episode so far because I'm just <laughs> fighting the same group of same chunky dudes and it's boring. Sorry about that. I thought there would be more exciting missions happening. But this chapter seems pretty intense. If we're going to be dealing with Antorion and we're dealing with this many mandatory fights on the world map. It's gonna be a slog. I don't care about running through him. Shoot his face. Kill this guy. Oh yes, I got it! But for real, how come the lower levels are the ones that have snow? The higher up you go, the more freezing it should be. Oh, well. We don't question logic. Uh, let's just kill this dude. Give us two resonance, we can do try attack. <laughs> oh, he has a machine gun. I don't think he ever actually attacked us though. Let's go after the chomps. There we go. Full scratch rate! Yes! Love it. I'm gonna steal all your money, dude. What are you waiting for? Whoop! Bye. Now we go after you. Fast charges up a tennis. There we go. There we go. Gosh, kill him! Zephyr, kill him! That was pretty good. That was a good run. There's only two guys left. Um, I might as well try to kill this guy with Leanne. You shouldn't make or should I try to kill him with Zephyr? Because Zephyr has two handguns. They could do more damage. Ooh! Hitting that target uh, airborne thing would have been super handy. Damn it, he's still alive. Oh well, Bash, go after this guy. Shoot aside! Oh, okay, Bash didn't need to get it, but okay. Is the, is the music skipping? What the heck? That was weird and freaky. Like oh, finally we're done. I can go to Crank Town. At least it's a leader assault. At least it's a leader assault, and I could just be on my way, live my life, 
This is not a problem. Uh. Dang, Bash is one level lower than Lian and Zephyr, but he still has 500 more HP than Lian. And 200 more than Zephyr. Oh, Lian! Your panty shots are giving me life. They're de stressing the whole situation. In an otherwise annoying grind of battles. There's no need to run, but let's just do it for fun. Might as well, since I set it all up. Crank Town! Let me at least do one satisfying thing this episode. Changing outfits. Okay, Vacheron. B. Fellow. Japan. Oh my gosh, he does not have a white shirt. He does not have blue jeans. We must remedy this situation. I must- Okay, after I finish the fashion lady's, um... The fashion lady's quest, we need to buy Vash a white shirt. Dark blue, light blue. Dark blue. Dark blue looks so much cooler. Um, let's take the glasses off though. I want to see your eyes, dude! Nope, we're just gonna totally remove glasses. Yes! Yes! Everyone in my party's gonna look so hot and nice! I can't believe I didn't buy a white shirt or blue jeans for a bash though. Ugh. Failure. No, you're not. No, I didn't mean to talk to you again. Just, where's the person with the exclamation point? Where you at? Are you inside the guild? Nope. 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 Any new missions? No. There wouldn't be new missions because I didn't finish any. Those two weren't. Maybe on this screen. It was Cranktown, right? Did he just say What's Alvin? That? Like Alvin and the chipmunks? Hey there. Hmm, yes, can I help you? Oh, you're here to get that shipment for the boutique. No, no, I haven't forgot about it. It's just that it's been so unsafe out there. It's been tough to find the right opportunity to deliver. So yeah, I'm glad you're here. You're here for the materials, right? Good, they're all yours. You fool! Wait, I have to talk to you again? Hey there. Get that shipment up to the boutique in Ebel City. Thanks, guys. You're welcome. Useless fool. Weakling can't even get past all the gangsters. <sighs> I'm so glad I built a energy station here. Okay, we go to the boutique. Maybe this will be my one crowning thing of this episode. I get clothes. Rassel Street. But that gremlin at uh, Cranktown dropped quite a bit of money. It was double digits, like in the 50s, too. Yes! Oh. Ah, you've brought that shipment of materials. Now I can get on with making you clothes. Thank you. Whoa! Come to see my latest, have you? You I won't be have come to see your latest. First things first. Charm? No. Please tell me you have blue jeans. Close enough. Fine. Heck no. That's as close as I'm gonna get. Let's... Okay. Oh wait, uh, but what new... 
That's gross. I don't like crocodile. That is disgusting. Uh, Ouroboros? Nope. Uh, clear? Nope. Black? Yeah. Karma? Ooh, no. Switch it back to the bee outfit. I can't believe you don't have blue jeans! Ugh, what new thing do we have for you? I think Flower was the last bit, yeah. Mm, maybe for her A? Oh yeah, for her A we got new clothes. Oh gosh, leopard print, no thank you. I don't like animal prints. <gasps> Berry's cute, but let's save my money. <laughs> Just in case. Ooh. Black is nice. This stuff? <gasps> Purple plaid? That's really cute. Oh my gosh, Leanne. How do you have so many freaking cute outfits? That's pretty cute, too. Orange. Little gold Hannah Ann. Mm. Anyway, I want her be outfit. And then let's check Zephyr's uh, A. Let's see. Love me! Oh my gosh, you can wear Pater shirt. No, thank you. Oh wait, that's just a vest shirt. Yeah. Nothing new for A? The ninja. Not bad. But let's save my money. Mesh. Nope. How come his A outfits don't really look that good? The tabby. Oh, this is all for his ninja getup. Ah, I get it, I get it. B. Come again. My only great purchase was Leanne's blue skirt. But look, no matter who I switch to, I'm looking good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm so weird. Oh. <gasps> Leanne's outfit is seriously so freaking cute. I would love to wear this in real life. Leanne, give me your outfit. Um, yeah. Uh, should I do any more missions now? They were all fetch quests type stuff, right? I want to see if a new um, mission popped up though in the guilds first. Here we go. Anything new? Ooh, feel better, kitty dog. Question mark. Could somebody please bring me some tasty meat that will make kitty dog feel better? Thank you. Level 10 Albona. Level 10 Albona and Barbarella's Manor. Let's head to Barbarella's Manor. Let's get rid of side missions first in this chapter, I guess. Level 10 Albona. Then why do I have to go- oh, wait. Oh, wait! I can go see Antorion too, duh. I'll go see the chef at Barbarella's Manor, and then I'll go see Antorion. And then that'll be a good place to stop this episode, because then at least something- <gasps> Look how good looking they are! Oh, everyone's so beautiful! Just in their classic white shirt and blue jeans. And Leanne's boots. Leanne's boots. Are so cute. Oh gosh. I just love everyone's bee outfits. They're so nice. Wait, I have dark purple, don't I? Yes. Bye. Finally. Woo! Energy stations will take me back to my base. Effect amps. Mmm, Barbarella. There we go. What up, chef? Huh. I want mama, blah blah blah. Deliver my... yeah, deliver it. Uh, where's your ma? Where's... wait. Where's his ma? Huh. Same, same time as you folks, right? She's loud emphatically. Oh! So I just have to go back to my base. Cool, cool. Okay, Antorion's Manor! And now I get to see them all in their cute outfits in a cutscene. Heck yes. Woo! 
Oh, I still have his glasses Always on, damn it. Always an honor to be asked for by name. Of course, I can't imagine yeah, it is what possible that old use a lowly hunter could be to the great Antoria. Yeah, you ditched the army. <laughs> you old fart. Well then, Bacheron. You should have declined my invitation. I need the money. I thought I'd see how unkindly the years had treated you. Ooh. I also thought you might be reopening old wounds. And I wanted to be sure. Old wounds, indeed. That dirty business with Victor and the rest. All because of one expedition. I haven't been on Rowan's good side since. You don't deserve to be. I think but you're a douche. without that past, there would be no present. Such optimism doesn't become your age, old man. Divine miracles. Men who experience unequivocal and certain death yet emerge alive. That's because their quartz hasn't been broken, though. It right? leaves in its wake the mark of the supernatural at the miracle's location. Your eyes are too shifty, old man. I don't trust you. I call you. it the sacred sign. You've seen it before, yes? Yo, he experienced it. Now to carry out the sentence. Oh yeah, and he shot Zephyr. But Zephyr didn't die. You missed on purpose. Now that's for you to decide. You watched me put the gun in his mouth, aim for his brain, and fire twice. But look at Crash him. Shots. He's alive. You're the witness. What do you make of it? He we must be demon possessed. Him like this, we'll be ruined. Hey, when your god survived his execution, what did he have to say about it? He didn't survive. He actually died. God. If they're talking about the Christian God. God have mercy. He died. He has been judged for his sins, and so he is without sin. Such is the will of God in his glory. What are you talking about? Somehow your connection with the miraculous runs deep. Is that why you chose <laughs> Fashion for this mission? Something of a you need someone yourself. with miracles? What's that supposed to mean? Well, you are the sole survivor of the expedition. I'm only alive because of the sacrifice made by Victor and the others. Really? There was no sacred sign? Do you want to experience it for yourself? Shall I shoot you in the face right now? If there was, I didn't see it. A prudent choice of words. Never stick out your neck till you've seen the axe. Even then, don't stick right. your neck out. I don't want to die. I thought I smelled money. Ah, what a sharp nose you have. I want you to go back. For me. Give those ruins another look. Why don't you go back yourself? You're the one who's curious about it, you douchebag. Old man, just go away from me, please. I didn't even get to see Leanne and Zephyr in their cute outfits in a cutscene. Ugh. Search for the Sega sign! Search for the Sega sign, thought to be Lucia on level 6. Well, let's go back to Ebel. Finish my mission. Hmm. I don't have a green yet. Or a ramen. Level three. They're all connected down here, though. Jean Palais. What a freaking loser. Oh yeah, what happened to Pater's Manor? Now that Pater's gone. It's dark early these days. Cardinal Pater found his own star from the heavens through the efforts of his father, only to die in the one town his father failed to save. Pater Topolis. Uh... Rawr, 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 rawr. Yeah. 
The re this remains Cardinal Pater's private residence. Surely you can have no business here now. Then why are you still guarding the door? If he's not there anymore. There has to be a new Cardinal, doesn't there? Oh well. Finish one more mission and then we'll call it a day. Oh wait, I shouldn't have pushed X so quickly because they were all uh, riding the elevator. Uh, we'll say the, if it's the loud lady, she's usually in Cheyenne Street. Hey, dude. Pew. What's that? Fifteen. Ooh. Um. Wait, where's the lady? Lady, where are you? She's not the mom because she's too young. You tell me you on Razzle Street? She on Razzle Street. Was my mailbox glowing? Yeah. Razzle Street first. That's a dude. That's a dude. Nope. Mama, where are you? Loud Mama, where are you? Seriously, where is she? Oh, there she is. She was at the top here. Good evening. What's that? You brought me something from my son cooked? Seriously? Well, let's see. Hmm. And now for our tastes. Not sweet. Not spicy. Not tasty. That silly boy must be getting too full of himself. This food is missing the most important ingredient of all. She's saying your food sucks! Oh, the dad and the son were talking together. That's cute. Let's see if there's any more missions. New mission has been added. Serious advice. Success has swelled my idiot son's head. Please pass my serious advice to him. Let's do one more mission before I end this episode. Because this is pretty easy enough. Let's just run up to level two. Good evening. My dingbat son cooks for Cardinal Barbarella. Well, he's developed a swelled head and losing sight of what's really important in cooking. I wrote him some serious advice to set him straight. I need you to deliver it to him now. Sure. Why can't you do it? I mean, it's not that tough to go... You're back! It's not that tough to go to the Cardinal's levels. Oh, wait, but you have to cross the bridge and maybe she's not tough enough to fight the gangsters. I get it, I get it. I should see if there's any new arena levels. But I think after this, before I move on with the story mission and other, any other side missions, I'm going to... Why did I press X again? I'm going to grind um, green energy hexes so that I can connect uh, terminals to the arena before I even try arena... Oh, Barbarella's manor is this eye. Before I even try attempting any new or old arena levels. Huh? Huh? Advice from my mom? It's not anything I would need now, don't you think? But sure, I'll relieve you of that letter. Huh? That liver letter you delivered to me? It got blown away by the wind. Haha. <laughs> it was just advice on cooking, wasn't it? It's not anything I need now. It's no big deal. I want to smack your face. You arrogant fool. Level 3. Okay, let's go and save because I'm getting tired. My ears are starting to hurt because my headphones are getting too tight on my head. Don't press X. Yes! I look fabulous and beautiful! <laughs> Exit. If only denim jeans could be as flowy as Leanne's. Like, that does not exist in real life. I'm gonna check the guild board one more time to see if any new mission has popped up. One more time. Nope! 
that was it. So now I guess just gotta head down to Albona in level 10. And uh, do any other red hexes that show up. And grind for green energy hexes. It'll be fun off-screen time. Woo woo! Oh, wait, mailbox. What's that? Gail sent us a gift. Metal coated rounds and first aid. Woo! Cool, cool. I think I should save those because they seem very special. I need to tinker more stuff together, and I'll seriously think about gun customization. Right now, too. I think I need to update all my guns. Ah, <sighs> but anyway, that was a tiring episode just because it was full of grindy battles. Ugh. I hope I don't have to do that again, but I probably will. Uh, but anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Stay toasty.